Well, once again, welcome to everyone. Our agenda today for the Demand Metric Member Orientation Training Session is on the screen. We're going to cover how to manage your account and find content, how to collaborate with the Demand Metric community, how you can get help, and then I'll give you a little bit of information about Demand Metric. And at the end, of course, uh, we'll talk about how you can get a free tool or template by attending today's training session. Well, you have a membership. Uh, I, I don't know what type of membership each of you has, but you have a membership with us, and that means you've at least stuck your toe into the demand metric pool. So what I want to do today is talk about what I hope will happen next. And what we'd like is for you to go ahead and take the plunge and get all of the benefits of being a demand metric member. So that's what we'll talk about this morning is how you can do that. First, let me talk about how you probably came to become a demand metric member, how you found this. Uh, most people have a need for some sort of a tool or template and they do a search using Google or some other search engine and they find us and land on one of our tool pages. And so you sort of form a perception that demand metric is a marketing tool provider. And indeed we are, we have over 350 marketing tools and templates. You see a list on the screen that talks about the categories in which all these tools and templates fall. So we've got a rich tool set that I hope each of you have had a chance to take a look at. And if not, I encourage you to do that by visiting our website. Uh, but there's more to demand metric. What we really want you to understand about us is that we are a community of marketing professionals of which you are now part. And uh, last check, we were over 15,000 members, and these are primarily marketing professionals and consultants. I would say about three quarters of our members are marketing professionals. The other 25% are consultants. You're part of that community now, and that community represents a tremendous resource in terms of knowledge and expertise. So before we're finished with our session today, I'll talk a little bit about how you can take advantage of that and how you can participate by sharing your knowledge as well. But you're in that community, so we want to welcome you to it. Before we jump into that, let's just talk about some details in terms of administration. Each of you has an account, and when you joined, you should have received an email that contains your login credentials. If you didn't, let us know, and we'll make sure you get that. Uh, you can log in and set up your profile. The, that's optional, of course. Um, you can also re reset your password or change it. And you have to log in to download anything, including the free content. We have a lot of free content, but you still have to be logged in to download it. If you are a basic member or a pro monthly member and you wish to upgrade to an annual membership or to add users, you can do all of that by logging in. Uh, and it begins at our home page and you'll see in the upper right corner the the bar that I've got on the screen here that says create account on the left and log in on the right and when you click log in it takes you to a page to enter your credentials and then you'll see the left side of that bar change to my account that's where you can click to go and do all of the things I've mentioned on this screen Let's talk a little bit about finding content. Uh, as I mentioned, we have over 350 tools and templates. The easiest way to start finding it all is to go to our home page and to mouse over the uh, premium content link on our navigation bar, or it may say templates. We change that link once in a while. But if you'll mouse over it, you'll see that large green box pop up on your screen that has the three columns to let you go and browse by topic or content type. So you can select any of those. When you click on it, it will take you to a page that lists all of the tools and templates under that particular topic or category. I like to go to the bottom of the left column where it says top 50 downloads to see what is, is popular, what people are downloading the most. The last time I checked, our methodologies were four of the five top downloads. You can also see what we've added recently at the very bottom in the middle, or if you just want to browse everything, that bottom uh, right link, view all content, will bring up everything, and you can scroll through it if you'd like to do it that way. You can also select the free content as well, and we have a link in the navigation bar for that. Every uh, week, generally every week to week and a half, 
we change what we are offering for free and we call that our featured content you can see this on our home page if you go there and scroll down just a little bit you'll see a section that says this week's free content uh, so I encourage you to visit regularly to see what that is if you're a basic member because that's an easy way for you to get some additional free content from us if you're a pro monthly or a premium or a team member uh, then you can get content anytime you need to essentially let's talk about some of the stuff that we have that is free uh, that's uh, very valuable even though it's free and that's our methodologies I mentioned these a minute ago this is a new content type that we launched late last year and it's very quickly become our most popular set of downloads to see all of our methodologies you can select the methodologies link in the navigation bar and when you click on it you'll see something that looks like this now it may not look exactly like this because we're always adding new ones uh, but let me first explain what a methodology is if you're familiar with our tools and templates you understand that those are for specific marketing tasks and functions the templates on the other hand are for much broader purposes of implementing a, a process at kind of a strategic level so a good analogy here is if a tool is like a recipe a methodology is like a cookbook so the newest one that we have available is the first one you see listed on the screen that is our Marcom plan methodology these will lead you through a series of stages and steps and they'll reference several of our tools in a process to help you implement a really effective marketing communications process likewise you see we have marketing strategy we've got product marketing we've got public relations things that aren't listed on the slide I think we have currently about five different methodologies so I encourage you to go see those download them and see if they might be valuable to you we also do a lot of webcasts I don't know if any of you have managed to attend one yet but usually we do one or two a month and when we do them we archive them and this is the place you'll find them if you go to our home page you'll see a webinars link in that black navigation bar you click on that and it pulls this up uh, just last week we did the developing marketing strategy webinar and that recording is there as, as well as all of our presentation materials and you can see that that one is marked free so you can go view that recording anytime you want on demand and see our presentation materials as well these webinars are all 30 minutes so it's real easy to just sit down and get through it in one sitting uh, hopefully it's pretty energetic we tend to get pretty good reviews on our webinars so if you haven't uh, checked one out yet I encourage you to do that here the other thing I hope that you'll do as you use our tools and templates is talk to us about them and we have a comment field as well as a sharing capability so anytime you go to a specific tool page and and this slide represents the tool page for our uh, marketing strategy methodology you can use any of the sharing icons in the column on the left to let others know about it and also you can tell us what you think and these comments are not read only by us but by anybody who visits that tool page so we hope you'll take a few minutes for any of the tools that you like or, or perhaps wish that they were better and let us know what you think about them let's talk a little bit about collaborating with the community as I mentioned you're part of a community that's uh, currently 15,000 uh, strong uh, this figure on the slide is a little out of date it says 13,000 we've added 2,000 members since I put this slide together the reason why you want to do this is there's several benefits for you and by the way this is all free all this collaboration is, is uh, available at no charge we use the various means we have set up to share insights from our analysts to provide commentary to make announcements about new tools templates or methodologies just give tips start discussions share how-to guides and best practices let you know about uh, events current past and future as well as just facilitate discussions so if you go to the bottom of our home page you'll see an area that I've put a, a image of on our screen where you can choose the way you'd like to interact um, the blog or you can follow us on Twitter we're, we're pretty active on LinkedIn and everything that we do on LinkedIn and on the blog gets replicated out across the other social media so I invite you to join our LinkedIn group and I think I have another slide that tells you a little bit more about that 
as well as read our blog. And our blog is where we just kind of start discussions. And I'll give you an example. There's there's certainly one on the screen. This is an article that we wrote uh, earlier in the year. Uh, just this week, I posted an article that really came from last week's marketing strategy webinar where I asked the question, which is better, the good execution of an imperfect marketing strategy or the delayed execution of a perfect marketing strategy? And that question actually spawned a debate that was very interesting to us. So we, we wrote an article on our blog post and represented some of the viewpoints we got during that discussion. So I hope you'll check out our blog um, and let us know what you think about that. I did mention the LinkedIn group as well. Um, I encourage you to go out and join the LinkedIn group because this is a great place if you as a marketing professional want to try and tap into the expertise of people in our community and ask them a question about how they're approaching a certain marketing issue or problem or share ideas or thoughts or ask for insight. This is the place to do it. And we also share our own here as well. Um, we have several members who will post articles that they've read that they found helpful that will announce events that they're doing or participating in. So this is a great place for that and I hope that you'll check that out. We do more than just provide tools and templates, even though we've talked a lot about it today during our session. Um, we provide services, and those services essentially let you put one of our experts on your team. And we can do a number of things in terms of providing services and consulting to you. Um, a lot of associations partner with us to provide our content to their members as a member benefit. We can customize our tools for you. We can create new tools. We can provide you content for marketing. Yeah, we can license our tools to you. A lot of people like to put them on their website to generate traffic to their website. Uh, we can do consulting and analyst advice. I've been involved personally with companies developing rebranding strategies, writing white papers, developing case studies, uh, all kinds of content marketing tasks. We can help with the implementation of marketing automation software, do training, and a number of other things. So the way we always approach the services tasks is we start with an initial free discovery call to understand what your requirements are, and we would provide you with a proposal, and you have the opportunity to consider that and accept it or not. But that's the way we approach delivering services. So if you have a need for some, I hope you'll consider us. So let me close with a little bit of a list here on what demand metric is. Um, we started as a purveyor of marketing tools and templates and still do that. We are also consultants and advisors to our members. We represent this community I've mentioned that you're now part of that has lots of expertise and a rich experience base. We can help you generate ideas. We can help give a project a boost if perhaps it needs some resource or just some advice. We're partners for helping you plan marketing strategies, product development strategies, product management and marketing, public relations, all of those types of things we can help with. We can give you some strategic insight about direction and things that you may be considering as a company. And we're certainly marketing cheerleaders because that's what we do. We believe in that. And we are available to you at your disposal. And so we hope that uh, you'll think of us if you have a need. Here's how you can get help. And here's what you might want to get help with. Uh, you might just need help finding the right tool. So if you are browsing through our library and you're not exactly sure what tool would do the best job for you, give us a call. Let us know. We'll be glad to help with that. Uh, we can help you using our tools or our website and certainly understanding all the options and benefits of membership and a number of other things. Uh, our general email is on the screen as well as our toll-free number. And we do have a, a, a number for international on our website if that number doesn't work for you. So what I'd like to do right now is I'm going to unmute everyone and see if you have any questions that you would like to ask about anything I've mentioned or anything else. So, David, Jeff, and Libby, is there anything that I didn't cover that you would like to know more about? Yes, I have a question. Is How does this contrast to some of the other providers out there like uh, Pragmatic Marketing and the 280 Group 
How is your content different, better, um, unique? Okay, that's a great question. I'm familiar with both of those organizations. In fact, years ago, I attended a pragmatic marketing uh, training session that was outstanding. They're both great organizations. Uh, they both have similar focuses, pragmatic marketing and the 280 group, uh, unless they've changed, focus on product uh, management pretty heavily. Um, and that's certainly a discipline that's kind of within marketing, and I'm sure you're very familiar with that. We have some product management tools, uh, but, but we're a little bit broader. We look at things outside product management as well. So if you go through our tool set, you'll see that one of the categories is product management, but we have lots of other categories as well. So uh, if, if product management was the only thing you were interested in, we certainly have tools, but they would both be good choices as well. If you're interested in things outside of product management, we, we probably will have more options. Okay. And then my other question, I'm a basic member now, is obviously you have a lot of templates. And I'm a small company. I'm interested. What if I were to subscribe and I get a template and it just doesn't fit what I'm looking for? Well, uh, what we would encourage you to do first is to let us know. Because if a template does not uh, meet your expectations, then there could be a few reasons why. One is we haven't described it properly, and so we need to fix the way we represent what it does on our website. The other is maybe it just needs some improvement, and if it doesn't work for you, we want to know that as well. Because I don't think you'll ever find our answer in a case like that to be, well, we're sorry, too bad. Uh, the template didn't work for you, you know, good luck. That's not the kind of answer that we plan on giving. What we want to understand in that situation is what is your requirement and what do you need to accomplish so we can make sure the tool meets that requirement or we might also have another tool that would be a better choice for you. So we always want to hear from you in situations like that. So let, let me ask you one other question. Is So um, kind of a, a little bit outside of the scope, but within the scope, um, is so do you partner with others outside to update these documents and create new ones? Well, we do. In fact, many of our tools exist because of requests we've had from members as well as partners, and we do partner with other organizations. Um, we partner with the American Marketing Association. Uh, they license some content from us, and we collaborate with them on creating content. We also partner with the Association of Strategic Marketing. Uh, we're partners with a couple of other organizations as well. We have a relationship with HubSpot. We have a relationship with Pardot. So we've got quite a few partnerships out there, uh, and we collaborate with those partners. Okay. Good questions. Um, any, any others? Um, I, you know, the, like I said, the other thing is I'd like the opportunity to look at a couple other specific ones to, to kind of see how in-depth they are. I've seen some of your free ones, but, um, you know, it's one of these things is that you don't see it, feel it, and you don't know if it works. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, if there, you're, you'll have a chance at the end of our broadcast today. Uh, you get a free tool just by virtue of the fact that you attended our session. So... I would encourage you to let me know which one you're most interested in, and I'll send it to you. Okay, that sounds great. Does anyone else have a question, or perhaps you have another one? Nope, I think you've done, done a phenomenal job. Thank you. You bet. Well, we'll take your questions anytime, even if you don't have them right now. Um, I'm going to give you uh, the information you need to get a free tool or template. It's real simple. Just go browse our website, find a tool that looks interesting to you, and let me know which one you'd like to have, and I will send that tool to you uh, as an attachment in my reply. So my email address is on the screen. It's simply jerry at demandmetric.com. So uh, pick out a tool, let me know which one you'd like, and I'll send it along. So with that, we're at the end of our broadcast. I want to say thank you very much for taking time to learn more about Demand Metric. Please let us know how we can help you.